actually starting up a business um, for adventure travel. <laughs> so it'd be kind of like um, you pay a fee and you don't know what you're in for. And you just kind of, um, just the company takes you and you go maybe it's, uh, yachting over to a small mountain and then mountain climbing for the day and you camp out and that probably goes for about a week and then you come back. My dream is that I'll graduate and work in neonatal and help lots of people around the world. My dream would be to somehow innocently come into a lot of money, um, buy my parents' houses, um, buy my daddy's favourite bike and wake him up with it and go out the front and just grab the shit out of it and wake him up. Um, take my best friends and see parts of the world that no one ever has. And then go home to a humble home and then have coffee with whoever she is. Yeah. Um, my dream as a... I actually don't really give a fuck about my engineering degree anymore. I've decided that I just want to leave that there and not really worry about it. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to start up my career as a professional skydiver and eventually within my 10 year plan is to actually own a plane and just travel around the world just creating little drop zones with my plane and just like take people that normally can't go skydiving and skydiving. That's my dream. My dreams are to have a happy life and to make a better life for those around me which is why I'm doing primary education so I can make a positive influence on other people. My dream is to travel the world and hopefully with my journalism be able to be paid to be doing something like that and to use that to help people that can't help themselves. Mm -hmm. So working for like Nat Geo or something like that would be absolutely wicked. <laughs> would be amazing. Yeah. What are you going to do? Um, my dream would be to um, make a difference in the world. Change the world in some way. I don't know how.